If you watch wrestling in the 90s and early 2000s, then you know there is but one man, and we do mean one man, that can lay claim to the title of the People's Champion. Nice shirt, 25 cents. Six, seven hundred dollars, it doesn't matter. Get out of here. safe sex, look at that! Rock could go in the back. Take off his electrifying $800 shirt. The Rock was telling people to know their role and shut their mouth so that the Great One could run his mouth. Shane, your role, know it. Triple H, your mouth, shut it. Vince, your llama's anus, lick it. Stephanie, <laughs> your dirty panties, wear it. On the microphone, in the ring, on the silver screen, Dwayne Johnson has done it all. It was believable that he could run and become president because he truly is a champion of the people. And it all started with wrestling. Who the hell you think you are? Brock! Brock! Bull, great one, people's champ, and oh, undisputed champion, so shut up, bitch. For this video, we'll highlight the very best of The Rock, from his catchphrases to the trash talk. Did you just tell The Rock, don't do anything stupid? This coming from a man who took a sacred vow of marriage to the biggest slut in the Western Hemisphere? <laughs> Today, we show you why The Rock was the original Top G. Few people could go toe-to-toe -to -toe with The Great One in a promo battle. The Rock regularly destroyed people on the microphone. Oh dear God, my name's Billy, and I just won King of the Ring. Everybody still thinks that I absolutely suck. He would roast and insult others in some of the most creative of ways. Benoit, all you want to do is prove things. Kane, since you just want to find things, Kane. you go ahead and find the penis Benoit claims he has. Oh Maybe The Rock is going to face Rikishi. I did it for The Rock. I did it for the people. I did, uh, shut your mouth, you thong wearing fatty. Booker T and Shane, the punk ass sucker, and the silver spoon, mother bonga. <laughs> The Rock must say you are looking quite gigantic. Yeah, we're gonna go to France, we're gonna go to China, we're gonna go to Russia, but don't worry, we get in trouble. We could use Stephanie the Man's breast as a flotation device. If anybody knows anything about screwing, it's you. The Rock's not talking about the winner of the match gets five minutes with your wife, because quite frankly, everybody's already had that. Who would have ever thought the man with 24 inch pythons would have half inch testicles? <laughs> oh, oh Heyman doing what? Probably laying naked on a beach, sitting there watching Brock Lesnar work out. Like a big fat walrus cheering on Brock. Brock, Brock, Brock. Perry Saturn, the Rock's gift to you. The Rock knows that you've got one eye that goes that way and another eye that goes that way. So the Rock will slap that crooked eye straight. Kevin Kelly, you are now Chris Benoit. Smile, jabroni. Aside from the insults, The Rock had multiple ways to trash talk and tear someone down. He was famous for making fun of people courtesy of some spot on impressions. I am the game. I gotta get in my pickup truck, drink some Steve Weisers, listen to some Backstreet Boys. What? Backstreet Boys? And even if the impression was a bit out there, Rock was so funny he just made it work. Big Slow sits there scaring all The Rock's fans. <laughs> Kept me down for five years. My name is Kane, and I am a Rudy Poo candy ass. <laughs> no, great one. No, no, no. Don't put me in the oven. Don't put me in the oven. Undertaker with his Mickey Mouse tattoos. Die, die, die. Screaming like a girl. <laughs> Don't see The Rock coming out and saying, What? 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 What is two plus two? Do you know Booker? Two plus two? Thomas Jefferson, sucker! We are the d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d d it's me, Mark Lloyd. Oh, it's me, Mark Lloyd. It's a dad guy. Shut up. We'll now highlight some of The Rock's more traditional trash talk. The Great One knew he had to be different and stand out from the rest. Towards the dawn of the Attitude Era, it became clear that the typical pro wrestling promo wasn't going to do anymore. The Rock was one of the wrestlers that came to the forefront thanks to his funny and incredibly entertaining promo style. The Rock talks trash in his sleep, just like this. Play the smack it down on the <laughs> camera. 
No, you're wrong. Uncle Joe Jericho with the glass eyes. Grandpa Jimmy Jack Jericho with the iron lock. It might be even Grandma Jezebel Jericho with the double X dirty panties. Oh, man, I can't ah, talk. She's a little tied up right now. Ah. Mary had a little lamb. Well, I'll tell you what, piss on the lamb, piss on Mary, and piss on you. Let the rock tell you in Chinese. Chinese? Ching bong ding dong, he's don't go aye! The rock is genetically electrifying. He emits electricity. Emitting electricity 365 days a year, including leap year. Even during his matches, the rock continued talking trash. Now what's going on? Shut over your here? mouth. Well, the rock listen to this boring crap, or I'll slap the dead right off your monkey ass and give it back to you. Hey, Whoa, step. Oh. You are a living, human, breathing piece of trash. Can I get a high five on that? Hell no. I give oh. you a slap in the teeth. How about oh, wait that? Wait a minute. Bring it. The Rock's got a nice rock burger with a little bit of extra rock <laughs> sauce on the side. If you can go right back to the rock, whooping your monkey ass all over Cajun country. How about the big Balboski? Get a meet of Mr. Table O. <laughs> Some Sometimes no microphone was required as the People's Champ continued talking trash in his matches. And with no mic being present, it meant he was free to swear and say whatever. The Brahma Bull came armed with over 30 different catchphrases that he loved to repeat. Do two things, and that is know your role and shut your mouth! You can just walk your candy ass down Know Your Role Boulevard right hey. back to hey. Jabroni Drive and check your big fat ass directly into the SmackDown Hotel! Some fulfilled different purposes, but one thing they all conveyed was how great The Rock is at entertaining the people. In four seconds, they will all chant The Rock's name. Rocky! 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 Rocky. Rocky. Listen to this! Rocky, Rocky. Well, they're chanting The Rock's name! Rocky, Rocky. The way Rock referred to himself in the third person gave him an extra punch of charisma. The Rock says this! The Rock says this! Oh, it matters what The Rock says. Well, the Rock thinks, no, he knows, no, The Rock guaranteed. As The Rock is gonna lay it, the smack it down on your candy ass. You have never heard The Rock means never. ever impress The Rock. Finally, The Rock has come back to the WWE. Yes. In front of the millions. It was another way for him to stand out while also being thoroughly entertaining at the same time. Just bring it, jabronis. Just bring it. Just bring it. Oh my gosh! Just bring it, JR! The Rock will still step right in the middle of this ring and say, Just bring it! Who in the blue hell are you? <laughs> Who is this Rudy Poo? Triple H, Stephanie, bring your Rudy Poo! Who it is you had in mind for his opponents? I'll tell you, Rock. It doesn't matter who you had in mind. One, two. There's two now. It doesn't matter if the Rock has the three. You will go one on one with the gray one. The Rock is gonna take his boot. No, take both his boots. Shine it up real nice. Turn that some bitch sideways and stick it straight up your candy ass. Well, The Rock says, he wipes a monkey's ass with what you think. The Rock saying spawned the name of a show, songs, classic video game titles, and iconic pieces of merchandise. The, Rock, I just a it doesn't if you just a the catchphrases created moments that made for brilliant television. Do you like pie? There are many type of pies. There's shepherd's pie, apple pie, the people's pie, pumpkin pie, <laughs> and of course there is the Rock's all-time favorite, Poontang pie. Poontang pie. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! You sick freak! You sick freak! <laughs> you sick freak! Sick freak! 
The Rock was a pure entertainer, and oftentimes he didn't even need a microphone to prove this. The People's Champ had numerous different taunts he used in the ring and during interviews. Toe to toe it. Because it. It's time. From spitting on his hand or poking fun at his opponent during his signature punch combo. Rock's gonna lay the smack down on his show. Yeah, smack me lay right down. Oh, right hands and right hands and right hands. Oh, look at this. He's fucking the Undertaker's motorcycle. Austin oh, still standing. Yeah, with a big hook. Rock misses a right. Oh, the Rock. Look at Rock. Look at the Rock. Look at the Rock. Oh, Flair stalled the pump ball. One move too long. To the pomp and circumstance of the people's elbow. Only The Rock could take a blatantly basic move like an elbow and make it a theatrical showboating finisher. The fans didn't just buy it as a legitimate finish, they gave the maneuver the biggest pop of the match. Be served. Oh, wait a minute. Smelling the electricity and The Rock's iconic turnbuckle pose taunt were other staples of his presentation. Get that. Lock the knot, man. As was the distinguished people's eyebrow, arguably the Brahma Bull's most recognizable mannerism. Rock was one of the best at conveying his emotions without saying a word. His facial expressions were always on point. His patented wide-eyed crazy look was especially memorable. The Great One could entertain the masses in a variety of different ways. Whether he was in the ring or backstage during interviews, The Rock's on-screen presence was simply electrifying. Oh. High five. <laughs> the Rock talked the talk, walked the walk, and damn sure looked the part. His wardrobe was very strong, from the sunglasses to the $500 shirts. He has some of the best outfits of any wrestler. This is a shirt right here that The Rock made famous. Some of The Rock's other signature looks included the sleeveless shirt and track pants, and the classic waistcoat and leather pants. Even in the ring, The Great One had nice drip. His attire was basic, but instantly recognizable. I never had an elaborate costume. I always felt that it was sufficient for me just to wear trunks and boots. The Brahma Bull on the trunks is one of wrestling's most iconic symbols. The open calf boots were unique because no one else wore them. Many wrestlers wear elbow pads, but only The Rock made such a basic item a part of the show by throwing his elbow pad into the crowd as the people scrambled to catch it. Given how entertaining he was in wrestling, it was no surprise The Rock was destined for success in Hollywood. Before we get ready to close things out, we'll take a special look at The Rock at perhaps his absolute best. The Hollywood Rock character allowed The Great One to run his mouth like always, but in a way that utilized his new career as an actor, allowing him to become an entertaining and hilarious heel. Who cut your hair? Ray Charles? Beat it. Wash your ass. <laughs> you ain't nothing. Five feet nothing. Excuse Rock, his cell phone's going off. Cacao, hello. Hey, it's nothing. He says he knows you. Let me tell you something, brother. And you know, you rip the shirt. And you rackle, 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 rackle. Can you fast forward to that, please? Well, let me tell you something, brother. What's going gonna do? What's going for gonna do? Rock wasn't just verbally tearing down his opponents. He was now also roasting the fans. Even when he was burying the crowd, the people still cheered him. Do you really want to boo the Rock? Is this the first time you've ever heard someone mention your city? Is that it? We live in Toronto. Yay! Shut up! Take all your booze, stick them straight up your maple syrup, suck it, can they ass it? The <laughs> best part about being here in Sacramento is in about an hour and a half, The Rock is gonna leave Sacramento! The Rock had outgrown the WWE, and even though it took some time, Dwayne Johnson was then able to establish himself as one of the biggest stars in Hollywood. The likes of Hulk Hogan and Roddy Piper had previously made the jump to the silver screen from wrestling, but neither were anywhere near as successful as The Rock. Dwayne's initial run in Hollywood saw him try and fit in as the stereotypical actor. However, Johnson didn't find any real success until he embraced who he was, becoming an action movie megastar, where he essentially plays himself in every role. Please, sir. 
May I have some more advice, sir? You want some advice? Here's a rock advice. Shut your mouth. If it wasn't already clear that the Brahma Bull was a man of many talents, he took it one step further with the hilarious rock concerts. It was proof he really could do it all. You ain't nothing but a redneck. <laughs> Whip your ass again. <laughs> a rock can't wait to whip Austin's ass again. Canadians have no class. That's why they can kiss the people's ass. But even before Hollywood Rock, the People's Champ was known for busting out a tune or two. It's why he's the most electrifying man in all of entertainment. Man, try me. <laughs> he can sing too! Poor rock bottom, sweet people's elbows, and an ass kicking all over New Orleans. Happy birthday to Steph. You're a hoe with big breasts. Guerrero and the Rock in this ring will meet, and when it's all over, the Rock whooping ass on Latino heat. Ay -ay 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 -ay. The Rock can hear the wedding song now. Here comes a test, and the hoe with the enormous breasts. <laughs> Wasted away again, a margarita bill. The Rock made an unprecedented impact on wrestling. In a short space of time, he cemented himself as one of the very top all-time greats of the industry. So much so that he was destined for bigger things. The Rock has done it all, having conquered wrestling and Hollywood. He had more catchphrases and talked more trash than anyone. He's had video games and shows named after him. He's had shows made about him. It's actually believable that he could run for president. The Rock is not just a man of and for the people. He's the original, undisputed, people's champion. Now, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out our video on The Rock's greatest catchphrases. Have a great day and I'll see you next time.